I think we're, we are so early. I think the future is everything we can imagine and more. Um, I think that the idealist in me likes to imagine, even as I'm walking down the street in San Francisco or in New Delhi or in Tokyo or in Sydney or whatever, I have a filter where every, I imagine everything that I'm seeing is being in some way, shape or form shareable. And that's really exciting because it vastly changed the urban landscape. So that's probably at one extreme. I think we're going to see a few different trends play out. I think we're gonna see a lot more companies, um, startup companies enter the space and I don't think that all of them will make it. I think a lot of them will not get to scale. I think, and that's not a bad thing, that's just a matter of, of how these new ventures work. I think we're gonna see a lot of more established companies entering the fray, uh, and I'm really excited about the approaches that they'll take because some of them will have to reinvent themselves or become dinosaurs. Others will look for strategic partnerships. Um, others will innovate and develop new products and services. But I do think we're going to see new company, or sorry, established companies start entering. And then in particular, and this is one space where I'm spending a lot of time, I think we're going to see the rise of the shareable city. And I think we're going to start seeing, if I have any, any say in it, we're going to see governments, public leaders, city leaders around the world start to understand that in effect, a city is the original sharing platform. And the city is, in essence, the single largest beneficiary of the results of collaborative consumption. And the city, cities worldwide, are dealing with fewer resources these days. So how do you do more with less or do more with the same? And how do you forge partnerships and do things that are more economically efficient, environmentally sensitive, and good for the community? So I think we're going to see an uptick in actually engagement by cities and looking at the role of the public sector in all of this as well. And I think we're gonna to continue to see it go, go global, for sure. Not just here in San Francisco, or Vancouver, or New York, or, or Sydney, but we're gonna see this massive explosion um, also in emerging markets.